Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to look at how we can calculate the difference between a start date and an end date and figure out what the number of months between those two days actually is. So the formula that we are going to use is the date diff formula. It is an unlisted formula for some reason in Excel, but it is an awesome one. So you'll see over to the right here, we have the date diff and we have start date, comma, end date, and then the interval. So the interval would be years, months, or days, of course. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go into our cell, our merge cell in this case. I'm going to type in equals date diff, open the bracket. Our start date is 2nd of August 13. Our end date is 4th of October in cell D5. And then we put in quotations M for months. And you'll see that it brings up 26 months is the difference. So if we change our end date to 10th of December 2015, It'll update to 28. Thanks for checking out this video. We'll see you next time.